Now, that was Attorney General Merrick Garland who says Apple has a strategy of anti-competitive conduct that hurts developers and consumers. Garland says products like smartwatch or digital wallet have to communicate with Apple's operating system and that Apple makes it tough for users and developers to venture outside the Apple ecosystem. San Jose State engineering professor and tech expert Ahmed Banafa says this could open the market for other hardware makers and developers, making it easier for them to get get into the customer base. The government is trying to make sure that they are not, uh, you know, uh, charging people more than what what it is reasonable and uh, and the uh, the customers will have other options and uh, I mean if I want to buy something which is well connected to my iPhone, I don't have to just buy the original uh, hardware uh, of, of Apple because it's going to work better. That's 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 the essence of the case. Apple says that they innovate every day to make technology that people love, protect people's privacy and security, and said in a statement, this lawsuit threatens who we are and the principles that set Apple, apart, that set Apple products apart in fiercely competitive markets. We believe that this lawsuit is wrong on the facts and the law, and we will vigorously defend against it. And Bonafa says that antitrust cases tend to take a very long time to be decided, even years. Gloria Rodriguez, ABC 7 News. All right, thank you, Gloria. A big day for Reddit after the San Francisco-based company went public this morning. You heard the roaring cheers right there as Reddit's mascot, Snoo, rung the opening bell at the New York Stock Exchange. Shares began trading today under the ticker symbol RDDT for Reddit, opening at $47 each. It's the first IPO of a major social media company since Pinterest debuted in 2019. Tech analysts say the IPO is more of a necessity than a choice. They have to monetize because they, they you know, they're income is in negative because of uh, the expenses they have to maintain the servers and the computers. The social media company has infamously never turned a profit. Reddit's debut on Wall Street has many analysts cautiously optimistic it could lead to other IPOs in Silicon Valley later this year.